guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video will not chance for a top video. I mean, I'm just building an army. Let's just be honest right now. Let's just put it out there. Celtic for weeks for Manon. Um, I thought at the start, is it just rumours because Durant is probably going to leave after the World Cup? No, it actually come true. For weeks for Manon is treated today. Celtic are in talks to sign Canada and Mont uh, Montreal defender Alistair Johnson. Or Alistair Johnson. I think it's Alistair Johnson on a permanent deal negotiation and going. going. Um, as Manuel Vef called, personal terms have already been discussed. Um, and then today, later on today, about two o'clock, he said we have reached a verbal agreement with Montreal to sign Alistair Johnson. Apparently, they'll now wait in the final details. Um, Johnson's contract will be discussed in order to get the done, uh, the deal done and sealed. Uh, here we go. Um, Celtic apparently have been verbal agreement with Montreal. Uh, for Alistair Johnson report earlier, the Hoops were in locked talks with MLSA, but now um, it's looking nearly done before the tournament ends. Um, the 24, he's 24, he's obviously playing at the World Cup with, um, in Qatar, uh, but still looking to final that deal before obviously the tournament ends. Um, Hoops man did report earlier that there's, the fear agreed ahead of the securing the personal terms with the defender. Man tweeted himself to have reached a verbal agreement um, to get that deal with the line, that's what we talked about there. He almost signed for Montreal in January from Nashville in an 800,000 deal. But he looks to set to join Ashworth's side, the versatile defender produced an impressive performance in Canada's World Cup opening in, in an Alfred defence Belgium. Can I speak Belgium? We looked, uh, I watched the game last night, it looked very good since we were getting linked. We looked uh, decently wet, he put a really good shift in. Um, but let's talk a bit more into him. So he, uh, personal terms, pretty much just need to be uh, agreed, so pretty much just need to get that over the line. Uh, let's go to Chancellor. So he is valued. Um, it's six million. Um, right back, of course. Um, you can also play at centre back. Uh, he's also with can Aiden team at the Qatar and was a standout in his nation's defeat to Belgium the other night. Um, he's been recently moved to Towns of Bologna. Um, um, a, a, a club also owned by Sa Saputo family who owns the MLS. Um, club in Montreal, but Celtic are also leading the uh, are now leading the race and. Um, fruits from my tweet. Um, a deal between the players has been agreed upon, formally agreed upon, moved to Scotland straight forward for Johnson's over a UK passport, so that's fine, which is brilliant. Uh, we've heard for these, you know, rumours and transfers in the past. You just can't go for the line because the time it takes for the likes of passports, visas, all that, you know, and had to wait as well because of COVID. Uh, and top is Irish and Canadian uh, citizenship. Um, it was actually first that it was Manuel Veth. That tweeted out that Mott was so Alice Jones going on a move to Scottish Giants. That um, he's, he's deals now advanced. Uh, for which man now we uh, tweeted that back and said, Yep, yeah, it's true. Um, and yeah, basically, Celtic apparently told to the MLS um, journalists they've, they've secured one of the top defenders in MLS. He can also play, he can play right back and centre back according to the transfer market here. And with a market of six million, he's joined him. The joint most valuable player. In MLS with Leia Lake Galaxies, Julian Argo, the, 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 the most uh, expensive. Um, he's in, he's right, he's right, rising recent years. In fact, he's been phenomenal. He was drafted out of college by Nashville SC in 2020. Jo Johnson was traded to Montreal, traded, you know, it's US in it, um, for around 900,000 in general um, allocation money. This is on chance market, by the way, if you get where I'm getting this information, right ahead in 2022 season. In Montreal, he uh, managed four goals and four assists in detonating games across all competitions in 2022. Um, and yeah, he looks an exciting talent. I tell you what, he looks really exciting talent. Um, a fee has been agreed. Uh, Future man has, um, has um, tweeted that out. A fee. Verbal agreement, verbal agreement has been agreed. No fee. Um, I don't know about a fee. Basically, I think the fee is agreed as well. Permit deal. No waiting the final details. Contract now is going to be discussed. In order to get the deal done and sealed, here we go. As you someone did say, so I'll leave it there. Um, that's another interesting one, of course. If we do get this one over the line, you're expecting your sort of your aunts to leave after all cup now, aren't you? If you get this one over the line, you're expecting your aunts to leave, so it will be a big miss, but you're getting a big, good player coming in. He's got the way you go, experience already. He's playing at World Cup, that's, that's, that's a experience and a half, um, especially for Celtic trying to retain that Champions League and obviously the. Main one, obviously, the league as well. About training that Champions League thing, going to group stage and getting better each year. 
I'm just building an army of this league. He's just building brilliant things at the club, and I can't wait to see this guy play and join, hopefully join Celtic in the coming days. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have enjoyed um, today's short chance video, please hit like button, subscribe, and we'll be back for anything else. If, if he does sign, I'll do what I do on a video. No, I can I say that, but I'm looking forward to seeing him in a Celtic jersey, hopefully soon, um, when he does eventually sign, pen paper signed. Um, contract just the situation done now but he does look a player and a half I watched him against Belgium Wednesday night he looked really good standout player um, and obviously you see it replace the Ants so you imagine the Ants will leave after the World Cup if Johnson does penalise that deal um, penalise that deal sorry and um, yeah penalty deal don't know what the contract in the years is yet but we'll see in the coming days what that's like but it looks like exciting talent for uh, the Canadian international side and on shall you know how quick that career went you know went from basic college and then Nashville and then traded to the USA 900,000 to uh, Montreal and then now he's getting to Celtic I mean what a career that is so far he just shows how good he is isn't he you know what I mean that right back he uh, must be a steal um, and I can't wait to see him in Celtic jersey soon so if you have enjoyed please like and subscribe and I'll be back um, for more videos on the channel shortly